just finished at the doctor's office and guys they took a lot of blood like i was starting to get a little queasy like i was like she's like are you okay and i'm like yeah <laughs> but yeah and then i had to do the urine test and for some reason i couldn't pee like literally i was just sitting there i'm like okay okay you know like i was kind of like oh maybe i should have drank water or something but you know what it is what it is and yeah i hate the doctor's office like i hate like just going through there sitting in that like eerie space and I, yeah i just don't like being at the doctor's office like it's always it takes forever everyone's like oh how are you like i don't know i just can't be in a space like that so i won't have to be here until next year november so yeah and now we're going to dunkin donuts oh, it's still gonna that's the true insurance oh sorry. yeah you're vlogging hi hi in there last people how are you doing uh hope you guys are doing good okay <laughs> yeah <laughs> so yeah we were talking about like insurance and stuff like that mm. but yeah now we get to eat i was so hungry my stomach was growling that was the doctor I don't nice. like going to the doctor. I mean, she's oh, nice. She's, no, you say I, I don't like her. No, I like, like, no. I like my doctor and everything, mm. but I don't like being in a doctor's office. Like, it's just so, like, yeah, uh, that too doesn't like being a doctor. I, I like going to doctors. I don't. Dentist. I don't like going Maybe to the doctor. I don't hang with people, so. <laughs> I don't like going to the dentist. I don't like any of that. Fish and bole. Oh. We plantain. Let oh, me show oh, you. Is that with the stew and that they have the stew on top? I'm just gonna show you. Oh my battery is nearly dead. This okay. is it. I'll show you. Oh, now this good. one is fish and bole. So you don't want tilapia because it's you don't because want I don't want to scale. I mean, I don't want to stop, mm -hmm. you know, but you have to keep on going because you never know when you're going to hit that, you know, something and you're to just... Yeah, this is it, but it's stronger than mine. Buy two, get third one free. What do we need two for? For next year. <laughs> next year? Where are you going to put that? I always put them up, oh, in, like the up fridge, in the fridge. Oh, like up in the... And yeah, let me use the lap here. Okay. You're, you're fine with skinning it and everything? No, no, they've already done everything. We both people. Huh. Okay. They've already removed all this stuff. Because the other people don't know about all this stuff. Yeah. So, let me just buy two. My mom went to the post office. And I don't know why I still have my seatbelt on. But can we... PSA, stop giving your kids tablets. They do not need a tablet at three years old. They do not need any type of social media as a seven-year-old. Stop giving them tablets when they're little kids. Let them read a book or do some coloring pages or anything else. Because I have seen so many TikToks of like the younger generation. They're like there's third graders reading at like a kindergarten level. And it's just so sad because, you know, when I was a child, like I didn't get a phone until I was like 12 or 13 years old. But like, we need to stop giving our little kids electronics when they don't need them. Let them pick up a book, read a book, do any of that because it's really ruining our mind and it's really hurting like them like 
their comprehension skills. Like, it's really bad, guys. And I'm scared because, like, there's a lot of, like, millennial parents and everything. And that's the first thing they do. If their kid cries, give them a tablet. If their tablet dies, give them a charger. Like, it's just so bad. And we need to stop doing that because, like, they rely on a tablet or anything or, like, computer. They rely on that for everything. And it's sad that anything doesn't go their way, they go to that, you know? Your kids do not need social media. They don't need a tablet. They don't need anything. Get them a book, a coloring book. Let them play with toys. Like, what happened with Barbie dolls, you know? Like, the whole Barbie movie came out. Why aren't we... Why aren't we playing with toys anymore? You know? And then the same thing with, like, social media. Like, they should not be... Anyone under the age of 13 should not be on social media. I don't care what anyone says. If you're 10, you don't need TikTok. You don't need Instagram. You don't need Snapchat. You don't need none of that. Like, once you're 13, okay, you're a teenager, you know? Like, you can use it. But you do not need any of that. And, like, I, it's really bad on your mental health, too. Because then you feel like you have to perceive yourself a certain way. And social media really changes you. So, yeah. Just, if you're, like, under the age of 13, you do not need social media. I just don't see the point because like like it really does hurt you like cyberbullying and I know like people joke around like oh cyberbullying just turn off your phone but how would a little kid know that they won't know that unless like you know but it's like very bad I still have this drink you guys like they put all the sugary stuff at the bottom so now it's like it's like really bad but this was a 10 out of 10. This was really good. Ooh. It's like very sweet at the bottom, but it's very good. And yeah, I wish I had a Dunkin' Donuts closer to where I live, but nope. And then my mom's at the post office. So once I get home, this is recording, right? I hope so. Okay, yeah, it has been recording. So yeah, once I get home, uh, I really don't want to write this essay, guys. I have to write a 750 word essay about a podcast, which it's not hard. It's just like, ugh. like I have to write a, about like something that like I can write about in a paragraph. So yeah, I just need water now. I wish there was water in the car. Yeah, there's no water. And then my mom, she finally got her fish at H-E-B. So, because the fish market, they said they didn't have any in stock. But she got tilapia, so, yeah. But yeah, I'm just so happy. Okay, no. I thought my hands smelled like fish, but, yeah. But yeah, let's go. I just finished my little study session and I should start going to I should start what am I saying I think I should start studying here instead of at home because I get too distracted and like it's not even on purpose it's just that like since I'm in my room or I'm downstairs I'm just like there and yeah I mean even like in, back in college like if y'all saw me I don't study in my dorm like it's so hard for me to study so yeah um i wish i worked on my essay in there but i'm almost done with this essay and it's not due until next week but i know like once i get on campus i'm not gonna want to do it so i'm probably gonna work on that tomorrow work on the essay tomorrow finish these two chapters that i really know i think it's only one chat i think only one of the chapters i really need to work on and yeah i'm gonna go back head to head home I need to do my hair and I'm just gonna relax because I've been up since eight, which is early for me, so don't judge me.
my last day here guys and I don't want to go back it's like 9 in the morning and it's super cold yes yes I have her keys I have my jello fries and yeah we're gonna head to Austin